Light men. <laughs> Hi, light men. I want you to take a look at this. Hey, what's that? I want a gym to see that. Wow, where'd you get this? I was trying to break into Protovision. I wanted to see the program for their new games. Hey, wait, Jim, I'm not through yet. Remember you told me to tell you when you were acting rudely and insensitively? Remember that? You're doing it right now. Theater-wide biotoxic and chemical warfare. This didn't come from Protovision. You bet it didn't. Ask him where it did come from, Jim. Go ahead, ask him. I told you already. Looks military to me. Definitely military. Probably classified, too. Yeah, but if it's military, why does it have games like checkers and backgammon? Maybe because those are games that teach basic strategy. Jim, how do I get into that system? I want to play those games. You're not supposed to see any of that stuff. That system probably contains a new data encryption algorithm. You'll never get in there. Hey, I don't believe that any system is totally secure. I bet you Jim could get in. Yeah, I bet you he couldn't. I bet you he could. Well, you'll never get in through the frontline security, but you might look for a back door. I can't believe it, Jim. That girl's standing over there listening, and you're talking about our back doors? Mr. Potato Head. Mr. Potato Head, back doors are not secrets. Yeah, but, Jim, you're giving away all our best tricks. They're not tricks. What's a back door? Well, whenever I design a system, I always put in a, a simple password that only I know about. That way, whenever I, I want to get back in, I can bypass whatever security they've added on. That's basically what it is. Yeah? Okay, you really want to get in, find out as much as you can about the guy who designed the system. Ah, uh, come on, I don't even know the guy's name. Where are you guys dumb? You guys are so dumb. I got this thing all figured out. I figured it out all by myself. Oh, yeah, Melvin? How would you do it? The first game on the list. Go right through Falcon's maze. 